Hello and welcome back to Fix It Aid. Now, I know you've seen this before. This is the amp that I got working and I'm going to give to my sister when she finally gets home from hospital. She's still in there. Seven months and counting. So there's a couple of things I want to address. Now, the last time it wasn't powering on and we fixed that. But a couple of things I want to address now. A, I want to check the power caps, the filter caps, I mean. Uh, the caps in general, just have a good look over it. Good clean as well. But also B, this power cable is so short. And it's not tucked under. Look, it's that short. It's ridiculous. So, let's see what we can do. And make sure this is proper, ready. So, let's take a look. Let's take a look. Cover. It's still rather stinking in here, isn't it? Let me get you in closer. I don't know if you can see the grime, but it's not pretty. So, let's see what I can do, Mr. Oh, I don't know why I keep doing that. Right. So, there's the two knobs that you need to remove to get this off. And if you're wondering what's happening with the Onkyo, I've been told that's how you pronounce it. Or oh, I hope I'm doing it right anyway. The Onkyo, just at the camera. Um, just waiting for the caps. I'm waiting for the capacitors and we'll have another crack there. This is the thing, see. Getting all of the parts is not quick. I know I've taken that one out. Oh, let's just take this one out as well. That doesn't get the cover off these two. Let's put deeper in. But the cover's coming off. Put that out of the way. So. An idea. There it is. Very dirty. Very dirty. Looks like this panel here just popped out. But our main um, main area we want to look at is these two. And once again, this hasn't got an access panel at the bottom, as you can see. So, it looks like we're going to have to undo a load of screws. Here. Well, it's not that many, actually. And then, try and remove it. So, right, so that's freed up, freed up, freedom. So naturally this board is connected to the heat sink, because the transistors are bolted to it. So I want to try and take that out as a whole, and I think it's just in two screws at the bottom, is it? Yeah. So this will free up. See how many? Right there. Aha. Uh -huh. See? One eight. And one eight. So that'll free up the heat sink. That will free up the heat sink. Yeah. And then two. This screws out this board. It's minging this board, it's very dirty. Uh, 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 uh. I'm just on the nose now as if there's any other screws. I can't see any. So I'll lightly try and 
Yeah, it's ready to come out. Is. Come out, that is. Come out. Ah, oh, you swine. Oh, I always end up getting cut. huge amount of room but I can see the contact points of these trying all these caps by a ginormous they're not ginormous so I'm gonna look to remove them so we can test them and then we can see what's what and while we while they're out it should give us a bit more room to clean up so First off, I'm trying to be as gentle as possible. Go do it, here it is, don't it? <clears throat> is right, so here they are. Put a bit of flux on. I'm gonna try to solve the sucker today, I think. Test this one while we're out. Not that off a side. First off, let's put that there. First off, I'm gonna check the voltage in there. Nothing, nothing in there. Right, so let's go down to microfarad. Four thousand to seven hundred it should be. Oh that's good. That's good. So that can go back in. That's got the minus sign on it anyway. So I'm happy with that. So we have one up now. Four seven forty forty seven hundred and fifty volts, right? So again I'm gonna check what voltage is in them. Nothing. Change to microfarad now. Bum ba bum ba bum 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 ba ba bill four seven nine four. Brilliant. Nothing wrong with them. That is great news. Oh, I've just did the bloody camera again. I don't know what I'm doing today. What's going on? That is good news. Brilliant. Turn that off a sec. Right, before we go any further then, I'm going to clean this up. Let's have I get some nice proper lock. Huh?
this that one in. This is one in. I'm trying to solder in a friggin' cap that I haven't put in yet. Just that one in. So I'm clean this one up a bit now. Let's get the glue off. That's really glued on there, so I'm not going to bother. Compliant as the other one. Let's quickly get some solder on here. Give this side of the board a clean. Right, while I was drying, we can give. this back in a sec. Get the tin screws in. Let's get them in. Uh, you know what? 
look at this a minute. Oh yeah, look, that pops out. So we give that a clean. That's not going to take much of a clean, actually. It's really nice, that is. Not a scratch on it. the screws back in this board. And then we can have a look at uh, the power lead then. Look at making it a bit longer. Was there another one? I can't remember. I think it was only two, wasn't it? Two there and two here. Okay. So I've got this power lead done. So the power lead comes in from here. Can you see this now? Make sure like, you can see this now. Let's bring this over here. That's better. Right, so it comes in through here, as you can see. And then up to the switch. Yep. Oh, drop my plastic bit. Let's put that back in. Yeah, so it's coming through it. It's just strain relief. And to here. I need to get that strain relief off. And the only way I'm going to do that is by taking this back panel off. idea of the watches because that's where I had to fix last time wasn't it? get a better idea of uh, what's that? Did you squeeze out my pliers where's my pliers eight, eight pliers not my pliers So it looks like that and clips from it. Yeah, get it me. Do it without that crimps. So move that back down here now. Right. So 
So here's where the power cables come in. So I've got to desolder them now. Here we are. Obviously trim this down. Right, sold us up a time. Do 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 do. Sold us up a time. Brown, blue, brown, blue. That's a tick sound. Rooted as it would be. Let's pull that back a bit. This is the brown. I'm going to wrap it around. See what I'm doing? Can you see what I'm doing? So, and I'm going to put a lovely big blob solder on it. The eagle eyed would see this in a couple of strands, don't they? So I'm just gonna nip them off now. There we are. Yeah. I am very happy with that. Right, so the blue will do the same again. Be a little bit more tricky. You gotta contend with everything that's in the way. If I get my tweezers, where have they gone? There. Not that round there. Try and clamp them up now so they don't interfere with anything else. Move that out of the way like that. So if I just squeeze it together. Oh, it's going the wrong way. Come on. That's it. Bend that over slightly. 
This wasn't the way. By Jove, I think that's done it. I've said, you know what? I've never said by Jove before, and I've said it on two videos now. Don't know what that's about. Anyway, oh, I bit the camera again. I'm just getting so good at that. So I just want to trim a bit of excess. Oh, split. See, got him out. Ha ha. So that's nice. I'm happy with that. So next will be the stress relief. Oh, oh, stress relief. I can do a little bit of that. Strain relief. So we want to feed it down here. Feed this down here. Feed this pipe. Pipe. How oh, can be pipe? Feed this wire down there through here. And give it enough. Right, so that's about the. That took some bloody doing, and as you can see, I've made quite a mess there, so I'll touch that up, so don't worry about it, don't worry. We're still all right. There we are, perfect. God, it's hot. Here is who made you. Oh, I'm sweating like Gary Glitter and the children in need after party. I really am. Get there. Boiling. It does ass back together now, isn't it? Right. That's a bit better. So what we need to do now is put the plug on. Put this back together and test it. Right, first off, have we got any further? Let's put the lid on that. So the moment of truth now, let me kill the lights a minute so you can see. <laughs> Ready? There we are.
So, until next time, thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this bit of a cleanup with this uh, classic Sanyo JA550A. Next videos to come are a Xbox One that won't power up and obviously the Onkyo. Let's get back to that one. But until then, I've got to tidy up, as you can see, because it's a bit of a mess. But thanks again for watching and... As always,